Jeanette has the following question. What is the difference between Dr. David Dyer's cell food and E3 Live? Is one better to take over the other? Or can drinking wheatgrass along with one of these be too much for the body? Well, E3 Live and cell food are totally different. Uh, they don't even resemble one another. Uh, E3 Live is a raw, frozen form of blue-green algae, which is 54% protein by weight, has every single element that is in every other living substance on the planet Earth, has an exceptionally high amount of vitamins and mineral profile in it, is the same exact essential fatty acids the human brain is made of, and by the way, I'll preface it by saying that's the only food uh, blue-green algae that have literally the same exact essential fatty acids the human brain's made of it. So we would take that uh, to nourish the body, and also blue-green and green algae, chlorella, have been proven to correct and fix DNA dysfunction. So it literally helps you prolong the life. If you do every, every other thing right, you think right, you exercise, you eat perfectly well, you have a spiritual thing happening, and you also take algae, you'll live longer than you would if you just did everything else right. So good thing to take. I take five forms of algae every day because I'm a happy guy. I want to be around for a long time. And then you have cell food, which on the plains, besides injecting sovereign silver up my nose to kill microbes, I also take cell food because stabilized oxygen, which is cell food, they take minerals in purified water, stabilize oxygen, meaning hold it in so it doesn't come out of it. So you have more oxygen in that particular mineral-based water uh, concoction than you would in normal water. And, and let me preface that by saying normal water for healthy people, drinking normal clean water, is where you get two-thirds of the oxygen from every day. So water in and of itself is where we get two-thirds of our oxygen from. Because what water is, as you may remember, is hydrogen and oxygen. Now going back to your question, stabilized oxygen you take to get rid of microbes, you increase the hemoglobin levels within the red blood cell, which allow greater uh, uptake of nutrients. It, it reduces microbial infection in the body. And as of this year, if you get on the Internet, you're going to see they've proven down in Africa that it kills malaria. And the longest it took to kill active malaria was 72 hours, and in most of the cases they tested, it was 48 hours. So totally different creatures. They go along beautifully with the program. I wouldn't go completely crazy on cell food because it's used as a therapeutic device where blue-green algae, you don't need tons of it, but the truth is consistent daily use would be a wise thing for you. Uh, 